the discovery? Who were the Neanderthals and when were they discovered? The Neanderthals were a species of ancient humans who lived in Europe and parts of Asia around 400,000 to 40,000 years ago. They are considered our closest extinct relatives, sharing a common ancestor with modern humans. The discovery of Neanderthals dates back to the mid-19th century. In 1856, a partial skeleton was found in the Neander Valley, hence the name Neanderthal, near Dusseldorf, Germany. This discovery marked the first recognition of an extinct human species. Since then, numerous fossil remains and archaeological evidence have been unearthed across Europe and Asia, providing valuable insights into the life and behavior of Neanderthals. Through scientific advancements such as DNA analysis, researchers have also been able to study their genetic relationship with modern humans. Understanding who the Neanderthals were and when they existed is crucial for unraveling our own evolutionary history and shedding light on the fascinating story of human evolution. The physical appearance and lifestyle of Neanderthals. Neanderthals, an extinct species of humans, inhabited parts of Europe and Asia from approximately 400,000 to 40,000 years ago. They were well adapted to the harsh environments they lived in and had distinct physical characteristics that set them apart from modern humans. One notable physical characteristic of Neanderthals was their robust build. They had a stocky, muscular body with shorter limbs compared to modern humans. This body structure was likely an adaptation to the cold climates they inhabited as it helped them conserve heat. Neanderthals also had a unique cranial structure. They had a prominent brow ridge and a larger brain case than modern humans. Their faces were also distinct with a projecting mid-face and a large nose that aided in warming the cold air they breathed. In terms of lifestyle, Neanderthals were skilled hunters and gatherers. They primarily relied on hunting large game such as mammoths and bison for food. Evidence suggests that they used tools for hunting and butchering animals. Neanderthals also exhibited cultural behaviors such as burying their dead with grave goods, indicating some form of ritualistic practices or beliefs. Additionally, they created tools from stone and bone materials, which were used for various purposes including cutting meat or fashioning other tools. While Neanderthals shared some similarities with modern humans in terms of their physical characteristics and lifestyle, there were also significant differences that make them a unique branch in our evolutionary history. Studying their physical characteristics and lifestyle provides valuable insights into our own origins as well as the diversity of human ancestors who once roamed the Earth. The relationship between Neanderthals and Homo sapiens. The relationship between Neanderthals and Homo sapiens is a topic of great interest in the field of anthropology. Homo sapiens, on the other hand, are the modern humans who emerged in Africa around 300,000 years ago and eventually spread across the globe. Research has shown that there was indeed some level of interaction between Neanderthals and Homo sapiens. Genetic studies have revealed that modern humans outside Africa carry traces of Neanderthal DNA in their genomes. 
indicating interbreeding between the two species. These interbreeding events likely occurred when early Homo sapiens migrated out of Africa and encountered Neanderthals in Europe and Asia. However, it is important to note that while there was interbreeding, it does not imply a complete merging or assimilation of the two populations. The genetic contribution from Neanderthals to modern humans is estimated to be around 1-2% for non-Africans. In addition to genetic evidence, archaeological findings also suggest some level of cultural exchange between Neanderthals and Homo sapiens. Stone tools and artifacts found at various sites indicate similarities in technological advancements and possibly shared knowledge. Despite these interactions, it is believed that competition for resources may have played a role in the eventual extinction of Neanderthals. Climate change and other environmental factors could have also contributed to their decline. Studying the relationship between Neanderthals and Homo sapiens provides valuable insights into our evolutionary history as well as our understanding of human diversity. Ongoing research continues to shed light on this fascinating chapter in human prehistory. The cultural significance of Neanderthals, art and tools. Neanderthal art, cave paintings, stone tools used by Neanderthals. The cultural significance of Neanderthals is a topic that has gained significant attention in recent years. One aspect of their culture that has been of particular interest is their art and tools. However, archaeological discoveries have challenged this perception by revealing evidence of their artistic expression and advanced toolmaking skills. Artifacts such as cave paintings, engraved bones and decorative objects have been found in Neanderthal sites suggesting a capacity for symbolic representation and creative expression. These discoveries indicate that Neanderthals had a rich cultural life that included the creation of art. In addition to artistic endeavors, Neanderthals also demonstrated impressive tool-making abilities. They crafted sophisticated tools using materials such as bone, antler and stone. These tools were not only practical but also served as expressions of their technological advancements. The presence of art and advanced tools among Neanderthal populations suggests a level of cognitive complexity beyond what was previously believed. It challenges the notion that modern humans were the sole bearers of culture during this time period. Studying the cultural significance of Neanderthal's art and tools provides valuable insights into our shared human history. It allows us to appreciate the diversity and complexity of ancient cultures. while shedding light on the capabilities and achievements of our evolutionary cousins. Theories on the extinction of Neanderthals. The extinction of Neanderthals has long been a subject of fascination and debate among scientists and researchers. Numerous theories have been proposed to explain the disappearance of this ancient human species. These theories offer different perspectives on what may have caused the demise of Neanderthals and provide valuable insights into our understanding of human evolution. One theory suggests that competition with Homo sapiens, our modern human ancestors, 
played a significant role in the extinction of Neanderthals. As Homo sapiens migrated into areas inhabited by Neanderthals, they may have outcompeted them for resources such as food and shelter. This theory proposes that the two species were in direct competition for survival, ultimately leading to the decline and eventual disappearance of Neanderthals. Another theory focuses on environmental factors as a potential cause for their extinction. It suggests that changes in climate and habitat could have negatively impacted the ability of Neanderthals to adapt and survive. This theory posits that shifts in temperature, vegetation patterns, or other ecological changes may have rendered their traditional hunting and gathering strategies ineffective, making it difficult for them to sustain their populations. Additionally, Interbreeding between Homo sapiens and Neanderthals has been proposed as another contributing factor to their extinction. Genetic evidence indicates that there was some level of interbreeding between these two species when they coexisted in certain regions. However, It is also believed that this hybridization may have led to reduced fertility or genetic disadvantages for offspring, potentially limiting the long-term viability of purebred Neanderthal populations. It is important to note that these theories are not mutually exclusive but rather complement each other in providing a comprehensive understanding of the factors involved in the extinction of Neanderthals. Further research using archaeological evidence, genetic analysis and advanced scientific techniques continues to shed light on this intriguing chapter in human history. Modern discoveries and ongoing research about Neanderthals Modern discoveries and ongoing research about Neanderthals have shed new light on our understanding of these ancient human relatives. In recent years, archaeological findings and advancements in scientific techniques have provided valuable insights into the lives, behaviors, and characteristics of Neanderthals. One significant discovery is the sequencing of the Neanderthal genome. This breakthrough has allowed scientists to compare the DNA of Neanderthals with that of modern humans. revealing fascinating information about our shared genetic history. It has been found that modern humans outside Africa carry traces of Neanderthal DNA in their genomes, suggesting interbreeding between the two species. Additionally, Excavations at various sites have unveiled evidence of advanced Neanderthal behaviors. For instance, researchers have found evidence of deliberate burial practices, symbolic art forms, such as cave paintings and engravings and the use of tools for hunting and crafting. Ongoing research continues to explore various aspects of Neanderthal life. Scientists are studying their diet through analysis of dental remains and isotopic analysis of bones. By examining their skeletal remains, 
Researchers are gaining insights into their physical characteristics, such as body structure and posture. Furthermore, advances in ancient DNA analysis techniques are enabling scientists to extract genetic information from fossilized remains with greater precision. This allows for more accurate reconstructions of population dynamics and migration patterns among different groups of Neanderthals. Overall, modern discoveries and ongoing research about Neanderthals provide a deeper understanding of our evolutionary past and challenge previous notions about these early human ancestors through interdisciplinary approaches combining archaeology, genetics, paleoanthropology and other scientific disciplines, we continue to unravel the mysteries surrounding this fascinating extinct species. How are the Neanderthals different than humans? Neanderthals, an extinct species closely related to humans, have long fascinated scientists and archaeologists. While they share a common ancestor with modern humans, there are several key differences that set them apart. One of the most noticeable distinctions between Neanderthals and humans is their physical appearance. Neanderthals had a robust build, with a stocky stature and strong muscles, suited for survival in harsh environments. In contrast, modern humans have a more gracile physique. Another significant difference lies in their cranial features. Neanderthals had a distinctive skull shape characterized by a prominent brow ridge and a larger brain case compared to modern humans. This suggests potential variations in cognitive abilities and behavior. Genetically, studies have revealed that there are genetic differences between Neanderthals and modern humans. Research has shown that individuals of non-African descent carry traces of Neanderthal DNA in their genomes, indicating interbreeding between the two species during ancient times. Behaviorally, evidence suggests that Neanderthals had their own unique cultural practices and tool-making techniques. They were skilled hunters who used specialized tools for various purposes such as hunting and butchering animals. While these differences highlight some distinctions between Neanderthals and modern humans, it is important to note that they also shared similarities. Both species were capable of using tools and engaging in social behaviors. Studying the differences between Neanderthals and humans helps us gain insights into our evolutionary history and understand the complexities of human origins.